The Amazon River runs mainly through the country of Brazil and through the Amazon rainforest. It is a tropical and wet climate year round. The tropical wet climate makes it possible for many different animal species to live here and make it one of the most diverse places on earth. Most of the people who live along the Amazon River are tribal and have not yet reached the Neolithic Revolution. That means that these people are mainly hunters and gatherers. Due to its climate, there is very little usable agriculture. A major resource that the river provides is its diverse amount of fish that can be used for many different things. The Amazon rainforest is 1.4 billion acres that spans across nine different countries, with the vast majority being in Brazil. The rainforest is home to many different species, both animals and plants. One out of every ten known species in the world lives in the Amazon rainforest, along with one in every five of all birds in the world. The Amazon rainforest impacts not only the people who live there, but people all around the world. The soil in the Amazon rainforest is only productive for a short period of time, so farmers need to move constantly and clear more land, resulting in deforestation which be, has become a huge controversial topic in today's society. In the country of Brazil, there are the Brazilian highlands. They cover most of southeast and central Brazil. In this area, there is great diversity. The soil there is very fertile, which makes gr great for agriculture. The average rainfall is 150 inches each year. In the Brazilian highlands, there is dense subtropical vegetation. The Brazilian highlands are also characterized by hilly uplands and low mountains. Some of the agriculture and plants are cactus, ferns, deciduous trees, and subtropical forests. People in the Brazilian highlands are able to live off of its subtropical vegetation and other agriculture due to its very fertile soil. The Atacama Desert is a 600-mile strip of land west of the Andes Mountains on the Pacific coast of South America. It is virtually rainless and is the driest place on Earth, and as a result, it is, a, it is virtually sterile because it is blocked from moisture on both sides, on one side by the Andes Mountains and on the other side by the Chilean Coast Range. It is almost impossible to live in the Atacama Desert due to the arid and dry climate. As a result, the Atacama is sparsely populated. The Andes Mountains are the longest chain of mountains above sea level. They run from Venezuela to Argentina through the countries of Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, Bolivia, and Chile. They create a rugged shoreline that is good for harbors on the western coast of South America. People have been able to build rail systems and roads through the mountains to be able to bring back valuable minerals. In the low foothills of the Andes, the average temperature reaches 80 degrees Fahrenheit, but to the south, the average is around 40 degrees Fahrenheit and very wet. The changes in elevation can lead to many climate changes. People in the Andes live by subsistence farming, which means they only produce enough crops for themselves. Many tropical crops are also raised here, such as banana, cotton, sugar, and coffee. People also use animals for their wool, milk, meat, and labor through the rugged terrain created by the Andes Mountains.